All right, greetings, folks. Welcome back to Single Player Survival. My goal for this episode is to attempt to gather all the materials we need for the museum build. Might as well show that off. Should have been there at the start of the video. Um, but of course, when we built the city, we added a museum, and I had the idea of, uh, yeah, debating whether it looks good or not, whatever. But the point is, it's a museum, and I had the idea of including a whole load of rooms based on when blocks were added to Minecraft. Um, so that's what we've got going on here. And we finished the city and the museum in 1.12, but there's been four updates since then. And it's fair to say three of them have been humongous in terms of blocks added. So we've got a lot to gather if we're going to add those rooms to this build. I have actually already dug them out. I've just not like done anything with them. Yeah, if we sail down here... Boom, there we go, there's one of the rooms. I think there's another one back here, yep. And then the other ones are... Well, this is one. This is for 1.15, this is for the smallest update. And then there should be another one around here for 1.16. And that takes us up to the present day, because of course 1.17 is not out. So yeah, I thought we'd spend this episode attempting to gather as many of the resources as possible. Of course, we did kind of start last time around with the ocean stuff. Managed to get the turtle eggs, sea pickles, kelp, etc, etc. So we should be good with those. I'll just double check my list. I did make a list, so I mean hopefully I'm organised enough. Um, but let me just double check. So for example for 1.13 we need blue ice. I don't think I've got any blue ice. I think I had blue ice on the old cake core SMP. I think Pat Knight gave me some but I don't have any blue ice here. I think you can easily make it using compressed ice. Boom, there we go, blue ice. So that's uh, another item ticked off the list. And you might think, well, it's a bit boring. There's not, like, it's pretty easy. But then you get to, like, 1.16 and there's netherite stuff. We need, like, a netherite block. Um, there's, yeah, there's all sorts of stuff, basically. So I'm going to spend the time getting that. And hopefully we'll have all in chests at the uh, at the museum in time for maybe not next episode but a future episode we'll uh, begin working on the actual rooms and we'll begin placing the exhibits and all that so I'm showing this part off as evidence that I I did actually have another plan this episode as you can see we're in the rail tunnel that goes to the garden farm uh, but of course there's two tracks uh, one of the tracks goes to the garden farm the other one uh, actually goes to a place I was going to make a mob arena yeah, I've not done that. I haven't really felt motivated or whatnot to, to do it, given the fact I've built mob farms a lot in this game. Uh, however, if we go through here, what I was attempted to do off camera was code a song. I have done this before in this game, just not very well. And the reason I, yeah, the reason I bin this project was it wasn't good. Let's just say that it wasn't good, and I wasn't it wasn't stimulating me, if you know what I mean, in the way that I thought it would. In the way that redstone usually does, it was more frustrating me. If you know, if you know, or if you don't know, I um, don't really know much about music. In order to try and you know quote a song in Minecraft, it's very very difficult. I pretty much gave up, but I'll let you listen to it. I was trying to uh, make the song uh, was it Time Back by Bad Style. It's a well known song in terms of being in the background of videos. I want to say it's unique in a way. Maybe not. I don't know. But this is uh, the start of it anyway in Minecraft Note Blocks. And there you go. Throughout that, you may have gathered as to why I gave up on it, given the timings were very, very difficult to pull off. The song was way more complex than I originally anticipated. It wasn't a fun time. Well, it was to an extent, but not not really. So I pretty much been this, uh, this project. It was quite interesting, though, learning about the different instruments you get from uh, different materials. So yeah, that, this was uh, something I was possibly going to do this episode, but I, nah, I just wasn't feeling it. Some people can do them very well, there's some channels out there with some 
really good covers, but I don't know. I just don't have the uh, the ability to or the knack of doing it. I'm not sure what happens if we chuck kelp into the furnace. I think do we get the kelp block out? I thought we had to craft something. I've never actually. I don't think I've ever made a kelp block before. Oh, I see. Okay, we probably have to smelt a bunch up. Well, let's not smelt at all. And then we probably have to craft it from there, that makes sense. Uh, one thing that I do want to do is make a conduit. So we need one of those. Let's dip into our fishing supply. And then we just need to do that. And we got ourselves a conduit. So that goes in there. I, as you can see, I've been gathering all the items and just placing them in order, alphabetically. Well, actually, it's not alphabetically, is it? Because... Uh, yeah, anyway, it's in some random order that I got from the wiki. I had to make all the variations of buttons, trapdoors, pressure plates. There's the normal pumpkin, the regular pumpkin that's uncarved. Technically, it was carved pumpkins that were added. Ooh, oh dear. Yeah, technically, it was carved pumpkins that were added in 1.13, but, like, I've already got carved pumpkins as regular pumpkins, so we can uh, skip that and just include the uh, uncarved pumpkins. There we go, dried kelp block, which I believe can be used for smelting. But for this particular purpose, we're going to be just leaving it in there. Actually, no, we're not. We're going to be leaving it further on because we need to make, what is it, dead coral blocks, dead coral fans. Do you not get dead coral? It's just the fans and the blocks that become dead. Well, let's do the blocks first because we've got plenty of those. Whereas... With the fans, we've only got one red one, for example, so if we mess up, then, uh, well, it's a little harder to remedy. That should die, right? I watched uh, Coral Block Never Dies. Hey, okay, it works. You just look away from it. Alright, so that's the tube Coral Block. Alright, chuck that down. Look away, because we can't be looking at it. Ah, uh, there we go. Cool. Right, I'll do that with each one, and uh, I'll get them put in the chest. The coral fan will be a bit more... Ch oh no, you can just place it anywhere. I'm, I'm guessing you've got to look away as well. And uh, look back. Ah, okay. How'd you pick it up, though? Do you need shears? Actually, we've got spare blue coral, so we can just use our... Okay, yeah, we, we definitely need shears. Alright, my mistake. It wasn't actually shears, it was a silk touch. A silk touch item? Any silk touch item? Okay, no, it's definitely, definitely the pickaxe. Alright, we finally successfully gathered every one of the the dead coral items. D hang on a minute, I thought we've only got two of each of the regular coral. But I thought this stuff died as well. Let's look away, as we normally do. Oh yeah, it does die. What? Why was it? Why weren't they listed? So I've managed to gather together all of the 1.13 blocks. There was a few more blocks than I'd written down, so we might have to expand the room slightly. Um, but now we're working on 1.14 blocks, and the good thing is, a while ago, I made all of these... All of these... Uh, wait, hang on a minute, those should go there. I made all of these 1.14 villager blocks in order to... Well, so I would have them handy if I ever wanted to create a workstation for villagers. That's not 1.14 block. That is. So there's two of these. Two of these that came out prior to 1.14 and then were obviously converted to villager stations. The rest came out with a 1.14 update. So we've got them. They're handy. We need bells. Surely I've got some bells. There's a lantern. I'll need that. Although that's... Did lanterns come out in 1.14? Don't remember. Where are the bells? I thought I had bells. Bother. I thought I had a bell. I don't even know where I'm going to get one. Oh, campfire, I'll need that. Alright, and it seems like if we can get hold of the bell, it seems like we've got everything. The only things that we're missing are all the signs, the different wood signs, the different slab variants of the different stone variants, and yeah, there's a lot of those. So I guess I'll work on them off camera, and then we'll go search for a bell, I guess. Alright, so I just need to get four blocks for 1.15. We're missing two blocks so far. So those are two blocks I'll go and collect later. Uh, but the two blocks we need, well one's a honeycomb block. Wait, there's a honeycomb block and a honey block. Ah, okay, so that's a honey, wait. Okay, so no, that's a honey block, that's a honeycomb block. Two different things. Does This doesn't have any properties, does it? 
I don't think so. I think this is the one that... Oh, look. Look at this. I didn't realise this one wasn't quite the size of a full block. Yeah, look at that. Okay, so they're both different. Although, quite clearly, this one here doesn't have any extra properties. And we also need three of those because we're going to create ourselves a bee nest. No, a bee hive. And then we're going to have to go find ourselves a bee nest. I believe I know where there's one. Around the area where we got the horses. What do we need? We need six of these. Six of these and then we can just throw them together. Okay, yeah. Beehive. Honey block. Honeycomb block. And then we just need a bee. Yeah. Bee nest is the last one we need. And that just leaves us 1.16. 1.16 is the last uh, update that we need to sort out. Okay, it's not that bad. I mean, there's a lot there, don't get me wrong, but it's not that bad. It's not terrible. Certainly not as big as uh, 1.13 or 1.14. Alright, I just looked at the list for uh, 1.16. First one, ancient debris. Oh dear, what have I got myself into? Uh, we do need some blackstone. Need some blackstone, we need some basalt, we got that. Chain, we got that. So, so far, things are coming up Millhouse. Crimson fungi. Did we actually pick any of that stuff up? I don't think we did. Oh look, there's all the coral blocks. I must have found some other time. But I don't think we picked up any of the uh, crimson stuff. Cracked, polished, blackstone bricks. Oh, it's just started hurting my head. There's so many aspects to that block. Oh yeah, I forgot to make this. We can make a respawn anchor because I've got enough crying obsidian. For crying out loud, I've got enough crying obsidian. So that's one of the blocks we need. All the other blocks are, or most of the other blocks are right here. So for example, I'm guessing this is one. Are we able to just pick them up? We can pick them up. Those we can also pick up. Crimson roots. What about these? Can we use silk touch? Yep, silk touch. We can also pick up these. Now these aren't logs, these are stems. So not quite the same as, as logs, although they do give planks, crimson planks. So yeah, I need to go and go through the whole nether and pick up all of the blocks that we need. All of the, uh, the new blocks, the 1.16 blocks that we need so we can add them to the museum. Hey look, there's mushrooms. These sorts of mushrooms. I didn't know they grew in this biome. Warp fungus. Interesting. Oh wow, look at all these guys. Oh hey look, we got some of this. What's this? Oh, we can't get it. Do we need shears? There we go. Boom. So what is that? That is nether sprouts. Might as well keep our shears on us just in case. Ooh, is that different? Or is that the same? No, it's warped roots. Anyway, we've got the warped stems. We found some of these. Whatever these are called. Oh, I just threw my shears out. No, give me them back. Twisting vines, that's it. Seem to be growing from the ground. We've never ridden one of these guys. I probably could if I wanted to. Hang on, let's uh, let's have a look. We've got sticks. Yeah, we've got sticks. Do we have any string? Oh, we do. Yeah, beauty. Right. Let's make one of uh, one of these. We can make that. And yeah, this is something I've never done before. I'm not sure if we'll need more than one, but I can only make one. Oh, I don't have a saddle. Oh, I forgot to bring a saddle. Oh, this would be fine if I had a saddle. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. There's got to be a saddle in there. Uh, there's going to be a saddle in this nether fortress. Surely. I've found one chest. In this vast area, I found a single solitary chest. Yes, we've got a saddle. I've only ever seen this done before. Right, yo. Take me this way. Yes! Yes, this is awesome. I'm finally trying something that everyone else has probably been doing for ages, but who cares? They're putting in a lot of effort. Fair play. Fair play to them. Doing my dirty work. Actually, we should be going the other way, because I need to get some... Uh, soul soil. Oh! Oh, I just got the advancement because I right-clicked. Can you drive these guys onto land? Oh no 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 go get back in the lava. <laughs> bad news bad news bears there. What is that? 
Oh, it's gravel. I'm gonna have to be let off somewhere. How about over here? That guy just... Oh no. Get get me out of here. Here, you, you better... Here, get, get back in the... Get back in the lava. Don't you dare come out. No. That guy's got death wish. Oh, that's soul sand, right? Yeah, we don't want that. We want this stuff. Soul soil. Take a wee bit of it. Don't need too much. Oh, hello there. Alright, never mind. Oh yeah, we also need this. Nether gold ore. Slightly different texture. It is called nether gold ore and not just gold ore. So we've managed to get to a stage where I've got most of the blocks. I've got all the 1.13 ones. I'm only missing a few from 1.14. I'm missing one from 1.15 and a few from 1.16. The list is... Uh, bells, berry bushes, bee nest, ancient debris, block of netherite, lodestone, and target block. I mean, the target block we probably just easily make. How'd you make it again? You definitely need a hay bale, so we'll do that. Uh, let's get the target block up. Oh, you need redstone. Oh, that's easy. So we can immediately sort this, and then I think what I'm going to do next is I'm just going to... Boom, there we go. Next, I'm just going to... Go and mine some nether. Right, I'll go and do that now. So, I managed to go out and gather together 43 ancient debris, which is pretty good. Is that, it, was, it was pretty easy to get, actually. I'm not sure if it's changed, like, the amount you get or the amount that generates. But we've got 45. This should be enough for everything that needs to go in the museum. So obviously let's get our 1.16 boxes out. First thing we're missing is ancient debris itself. So that will go there. Next thing we're missing is a block of netherite. That will be the vast majority of this. We also need a lodestone which is one netherite. We've already made the target block, so all that's left is I need to smelt all of this up. I don't need to save it. Imagine trying to build with this. I mean, could you realistically build something? I, I suppose you could. I don't feel the top texture would be that useful to build with, but at the same time... Yes, the side texture does have a, a funky colour which may or may not be uh, usable for expert builders. Alright, I just need to remind myself how to make a lodestone. I think you need, okay, you need chiseled stone bricks surrounding a netherite ingot. Got plenty of those. Uh, so let's now go ahead and craft our netherite ingots. We need, oh wait, we only get 11? Is that enough? That, wait, yeah, that, that's enough. Yeah, yeah, that's enough. Okay. So first of all, we need the netherite block. First one I've ever made. Uh, then we need the lodestone, which we can do like that. You can actually find these in... Uh, the remnants, the whatever they're called, the remnant structures. I think that's what I found mine. And if I could just double check my list, I believe we've got everything. Target block we've got, yeah. So with this final piece of ancient debris, we're going to waste it. Uh, I remember Zedger speaking to me about this when these first came out, but uh, yes, we're going to. Uh, we're going to. Oh, wait, where, where is it? It's over here. We're going to upgrade our diamond garden utensil with that. Oh, what we... Oh, thank goodness. I was going to say we never got the uh, advancement, but we managed to, to do just that. Yep, I have just reevaluated my life choices. Epic. Alright. So that should mean we've got everything from 1.16. Right. I need to go find a bell. Uh, berry bushes and bee nests. Those are the three things I need to go and find. I know where there's a bee's nest. Bells, I've got a rough idea. Berry bushes. Actually, bells, I'm not really sure. Because all the villages, like the newer villages I was looking at, was along the... Uh, they were all along the long rail track, and I don't fancy going along there again. <laughs> no chance. Oh, look, there's some sweet berry bushes. Nice. So how'd you pick these up? Is it just like... Do you just... Yeah, okay. Okay, yep, that's that's pretty cool. Pick up a few. Yeah, over here. Right, surely there's a bell here. Let's have a look. Come on. Every village has a bell, right? I'm sure I had a bell. I just don't know where it is. Hey, there's one. 
Yep, it's definitely Bell. The sound checks out. And I think that is everything we need. Hey, Lapis. Yeah, I think that's everything we need. So I'm going to head back, fill the chests, and then we're going to go and take them over to the museum. Okay, so I've moved all of the items over to the museum. I've also extended each of the rooms. As you can see, they're a lot bigger now. Well, it's kind of hard to tell. Some of them are a lot bigger. Some of them didn't change in the slightest. But yeah, this is where all of the the blocks will be going. We'll probably work at the museum in a couple of episodes. Just kind of get it ready and uh, get it sorted. We're going to have to extend the walkway. And yeah, that'll take us up to the present day if we can pull it off. But we've done the hard work. We've got together all, or most of the blocks anyway. It should make things easier come the time that we actually work on it. And so with that all said and done, I think I'm going to leave this episode there for the day. I've we managed to accomplish a lot. I've accomplished even more than I've shown, given the fact I attempted to use command blocks. Uh, not command blocks, sorry. Uh, no, I've definitely not been using any command blocks in this world. Uh, note blocks. Since I was doing that note block song, I was working a long time on that and getting nowhere. And then obviously we made good progress on the museum stuff, so yeah, I'm satisfied, sort of. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I will see you for the next one.